Hey, hey, Demetria Davenport here, the massage doctor. Today I came across some information I want to share with you guys about uh, sleep apnea and people um, who are suffering from sleep apnea have to use a CPAP. So I hear, I printed out a picture figure right here. Now this is a person that's sleeping and their airway, air pathway is open right here. So what happens when you have a uh, sleep apnea, um, you snore loud, you may pause and stop breathing for a couple of seconds, and then you may do that throughout the night, and then you wake up really tired because you're um, waking yourself up and catching your breath and breathing. So what happens is, here's another diagram. You're sleeping, these are your air pathways. This is breathing in through your nose, breathing in through your mouth. But if you see right here, the tongue falls back and it blocks that air pathway right there. Okay, here's the first picture. You see the air pathway is open and the tongue is not falling back right here. Like it is on this picture, the tongue falls back. And what happens is um, you're getting negative air pressure that's coming in and it's causing the tongue to fall back so what the uh, CPAP does, it pushes in positive airflow, and when you have your CPAP mask on, you're breathing in through your nose, here, not through your mouth, as you see, the mouth is closed, and then the tongue is not falling back, the air pathway is open, okay? So um, CPAP stands for Continuous positive airway pressure um, is form is a form of positive airway pressure uh, ventilator which applies mild air pressure on a continuous basis to keep the airways um, continuously open and people who are able to breathe um, spontaneously on their own uh, on their own but they need help to keep their airway um, air pathway um, unobstructed okay so what the CPAP does guys again like I said it it's a positive air pathway and it keeps that tongue from let's put it in positive um, air pathway pressure okay and it's stopping that tongue from falling back I hope this information was very helpful to you guys the massage doctor signing out love you bye and always Make sure before you make any changes to your health care regimen, always consult with your primary care physician. Love you. Bye.